This is the delicate leaves of Asa Suryu. So the 24th of July 2017. Asa Suryu is supposed to be the only true upright dissectum in Japanese maples. And it's one of my favourite trees. I think it's because it looks so delicate, it has very small, fine leaves. And it's also the colours as well. The tree in the last three, three years since we've had it does tinge and turn red during the summer. But this year, as with several of other Japanese maples, We've seen a lot, a lot more redden, reddening of the leaves, and unfortunately, cameras overexposed, and, and those reds look a lot lighter than they actually are. We still have some greens on the back of the tree there, that's been shaded a little bit by the upper leaves. lovely light tone of green we've had a, a shady spot in the garden and I think I'd prefer to, to try it there but at the moment most of our garden does get quite a lot of sun. But the colours are lovely, they really contrast against the darker greens in the garden. I've had this tree three years now, it's repotted in March, gone. It had a lot of pruning a, few, a couple of years ago because it was a little bit messy. It hasn't really had a great deal of growth since we've got it compared to some other ASSOUs I've seen and I've researched that you know, a good grower, a fast grower, this one's been slow and steady. We've had a good few inches growth this year, width-wise and height-wise. Like I say, I want to separate some of those leaf, uh, main stems at the back there, a little bit further apart, and it's it's got quite a nice shape once you pull those branches apart. So. Um, a lot lighter on film than actually it is. But really it's a lovely tree here, so I see you. You can subscribe or check back later on in the year and see how this one changes until it loses its leaves in late October. Okay, thanks for watching.